Hey, it's Jason. In this video, we're going to talk about how to add AdSense to your WordPress site. Now, at any time, you can visit enlightenedwebmastery.com and see the full article and print it out, reference it for later use. Now, there are some things you need to consider before adding AdSense to your website. Now, back in the day, it used to be very, very profitable to have AdSense on your website. Google would be sending out FedEx checks whenever you get like a thousand, ten thousand dollars, whatever back then but today you're not gonna be getting those big checks you're gonna be getting around two hundred dollars twenty dollars fifty dollars three hundred dollars something like that a month it's not gonna be huge and it may or may not be even good for your website you might not even earn nothing you're just giving away free ads on your website so you really need to consider if adding ads into your blog is the right thing to do also if you're using another ad network like maybe Yahoo or auction ads some other kind of place or if you have a certain advertiser on your website they may not really want you to be using AdSense on your website not only that they could use Google and place AdWord campaigns on your website and instead of paying you five hundred to a thousand dollars a month to advertise on your website they could be paying Google uh, twenty cents fifty cents a click on your website and be on there for possibly much cheaper so you really want to think things through before you just start adding WordPress, I mean before you start adding AdSense to your WordPress site. So now that we've talked about what you need to consider and what your realistic expectations should be, let's talk about how to add it to your website. So if modifying your template isn't the best thing for you to do, you can just go ahead and add a plug into your website. This way the code will automatically be integrated into your website and you can just as easily get rid of it if it's not working for you. So to do that, what you're going to want to do is add the all-in-one AdSense plugin. I have the link on my website at enlightenedwebmastery.com or you can Google the name. So after you've had the plugin, you just need to go ahead and do your usual where you install it and activate it and then you need to put in your AdSense publisher ID. And if you don't have an AdSense publisher ID, you need to sign up for an AdSense account, which you will need to be approved before you start earning money or probably even before they can start showing ads. To sign up for an account for them, you just go to google.com forward slash AdSense. So, as with everything, whenever you add this to your website, what you're going to want to do is test, test, test. Make sure you're not losing visitors or losing sales or losing anything. You may be turning people off. You may experience a higher bounce rate. People may not like your website no more or could not affect anybody and you could make a few more dollars a week. So, test it out and have fun.